hill and it is pouring rain outside so I may not be able to give you shots from the outside at least right now but when you walk inside the front door right here there is a little two-story foyer and got a little rail up there overlooking beautiful chandelier and there is a little bench up there above the front door for your decorations and the red front door there is formal living room with mm, I would say 8 foot ceilings right to the left side of the foyer the size of it is I'm guessing 15 by 13 it's all hardwood nicely painted To the right from the front door is a beautiful dining room with tray ceiling. Same size, probably 15 by 11 or 12. Two windows. Beautiful tray rail and wainscoting. Also hardwood floors throughout. Then we're walking through. We see a bathroom on your right. Bathroom is nice size. It's probably about five by five, maybe four by four. I'd say between four and five. It does a crown molding in the bathroom and stumped ceiling. And also hardwood floors, wooden HVAC vent, and again pedestal sink. On the other side, you'll see coat closet, deep coat closet with additional storage underneath the uh, staircase. Then we're walking into the family room. And when you walk through the family room, you get into the laundry room and a garage. With beautiful tile floors. This is the laundry room with cabinets above the washer and dryer and folding counter. Decent sized sink. And straight through there is a garage and it is true two-car garage there is no extra space in the garage unless you put some kind of shelves it does have a central vacuum cleaner I have to ask about generator but at least they do have a generator switch so we have to find out if there is a generator. They do have a gas water heater with instant hot water. The little pump on the top of the water heater is for instant hot water. It's pushing water through the pipes so whenever you turn the water on it is hot. And they do have a 
HVAC unit I can't tell you exactly if it's original or replaced but they do have a uh, built-in humidifier and also it's gas heat so it's going to be more efficient than electric and Mercedes doesn't convey with the house I guess it's got nice large two windows both are both doors are with uh, garage door openers Going back inside, on the other side of the hallway, there's a master bedroom. And the master bedroom size is probably about 17 by 17, 16, something like that. It's a large bedroom. It's got uh, one double window on one wall and nice tray ceilings. It's got built-in speakers. I have to find out a little bit more about the speaker sy surround system in the house. And controls for a fan, but I don't know what that is. Again, shot of the bedroom. Then Going forward, this is the master bedroom. I'm sorry, master bathroom. It has tiles on the floor. Everything looks extremely clean. Bathtub fixtures are a little bit updated. I'm sorry, outdated, but it's very clean. It's got glass tile window. There is a little linen closet right by the bathtub. Huge walk in shower. And again, it is brass, maybe a little outdated, but still, I think, looks very good. Granite countertop and two sinks three large mirrors lots of recessed lights and a ceiling fan this is the shower with the sitting bench a few shelves basic shower but it's very large I would say it's about four by six feet again master bedroom closet it does have a large closet it's narrow it's probably about six feet by 15 or so so closet is large But it is single closet, just to let you know. Family room.
This is a shared bathroom upstairs. Dual sinks. Stainless steel fixtures. And basic bathtub. At least all finishes are matching here. There is a little linen closet. And it is accessible from one of the bedrooms. And the bedroom size is about 14 by 12. And that's the entrance to the bedroom and the bathroom from the bedroom. And when you walk out, you're right by the foyer. And it's still raining. One more linen closet of the hallway. And then we're going back here. There's additional bedroom. It is a little smaller, it's probably about 13 by 10, maybe 11. It's got a regular dual closet. And it's a good guest bedroom. Then there is another bedroom right here. They're using this place as a gym. It is also probably a 12 by 12 bedroom with regular dual closet and single window. Inexpensive ceiling fan. Carpets are in great condition. Everything looks really good. Again, family room from upstairs. And this is the uh, bonus room. Very large room, two large windows. Uh, room size is about 20 by 20. Uh, eight foot ceilings. There's a pool table and from the corner you can tell that room itself is really spacious and this could be a great playroom, uh, hobby room or whatever you would like to do upstairs. Also looks like carpet was either washed freshly or they really didn't use this room at all. There is unfinished attic space, plenty of storage, beautiful place that will accommodate basically anything you want to store. My camera is not adjusting quickly enough to show you that there is a little bit more storage on this side, but this room is probably about 20 by about over the 20 by 20 as well it could be finished into uh, additional bathroom and one more bedroom I don't know if it makes sense but if you're looking for more space it could be done for fairly inexpensive on the other side there is one more storage in the eaves so that would be more storage for you it goes on so I don't think you'll be able to run out of storage in this house and again I'll get a shot of hallway one bedroom is right there shared bathroom guest bedroom that has direct access to the bathroom and there's another bedroom on this side and right behind me is the big bonus room shot of the staircase and let me look at the kitchen. This is your breakfast room and a kitchen. It's got stainless steel appliances with gas stove and a pantry in the corner. Beautiful. 
custom cabinets, double oven, island with extra workspace, It does have some scratches from cleaning, but it's in really good shape. Double ovens from KitchenAid. All wood drawers, so for high-end cabinets. China cabinet and built in microwave, side by side refrigerator. I don't see anywhere on the cabinets, looks really good. It has triple white sink. And usually cabinets underneath the sink has the, have the most wear. This looks really good. Matching kitchen aid dishwasher. Can't find right now how quiet that one is, but looks like it will be one of those very quiet dishwashers. Then we have a little built-in desk with matching countertop, a few open shelves, and a few corner cabinets for displays. And again, large pantry for everything that you want to store. And one more shot of the kitchen. And again by the front door, family room, and a dining room. Let's go outside.